Hello everyone and welcome to the February newsletter of ISD 181. I'm Lane Larson, Superintendent of Schools, and I want to welcome you to what we refer to as Fabulous February. We've been referring to it as Fabulous February in our written communication and our verbal communication because it was the time that we got to bring all of our students back to school in person with their teachers. The joy on our students' faces, our teachers' faces, and our community is immeasurable, and it is so exciting to have our students back. There's not a lot of items to talk about today in our video newsletter because we're just getting started and we intend to finish our school year strong. We have three months where if we continue to implement the mitigation strategies that we've been asked to do, we hope to keep our school students in session until the remainder of the school year. How do we do that? Again, please wear your face mask when in the company of others. Please maintain the three to six foot social distancing. Wash your hands frequently. Cover your mouth when you have a cough and stay out of large crowds whenever possible. We're just so excited to have our kids back and we want to stay that way for the remainder of the year so we can finish this school year really strong and really fun for all of our students that are in school. The other things that I'd like to talk about today is since our sports seasons were extended a little bit, we're going to be celebrating the state competitions that our kids are in in the months of March and in April. There is one thing that I'd like you to really note though, is that at the last meeting of the Board of Education, the board approved the next two school years worth of calendars. The school calendar for 2021-22 and the school calendar for 2022-23 are approved and they are online on our district website. You'll notice that there are two changes in our calendar this year. First of all, there's two additional professional development days where we can do training to help close that achievement gap that we might have lost during the pandemic. And also, there are no more snow days. We're going to be using those days as e-learning or what we refer to as distance learning days. We've gotten quite good at that through the pandemic. And finally, the last thing I'd like to end with today is please put on your calendar Saturday, May 1st as we are going to have the grand opening to what we refer to as the Performing Arts Center. This coming Monday at our board meeting, we're going to be naming that facility, but we're excited to dedicate it and start using it with our students before the school year ends. Thank you everyone for your partnership, for your friendship, and for supporting us through this interesting pandemic of a year. Together, we are doing what's best for our students, our staff, and our entire school district. We truly are a partnership focus, focused on educational excellence. Have a wonderful month, and I'll see you at the end of March.